Hey guys, it's June from Charming Vault, and I'm gonna show you how to hang your rear view mirror charms. This here is a Dungeons and Dragons charm with about a 15 to 18 inch length chain. Um, most people will hang it from their rear view like this, um, but the negative side to that is that they're unevenly weighted. So one side will hang further down than the other while you're driving and they'll move around. They can swing and hit your um, your window and we don't want that to happen because we don't want any damage. Typically our charms are pretty small so it is likely they won't cause any damage. But to avoid that, we recommend hanging them about three to four inches below the rear view mirror. So we pull one end to the desired weight and we can hold that in place, um, which I usually do. Sometimes it moves and that's okay. And then we wrap the other side around until we reach the desired length. So here we go, we're wrapping it around a few times. Uh, everybody's mirror is gonna be different because they're different sizes. Uh, here we have them, they're approximately the same length. I actually prefer them to be uh, one longer than the other. Some people like this, um, but I don't. So I'm gonna unravel it here, and then I'm gonna kind of just maneuver it to um, become the length that I want it to become. So I, you see me unwrapping a couple times, trying to figure out what side do I want the dice to go on. So I'm gonna wrap the dice around because I'm like, you know what, let me just make that one a little shorter that way. And then here I go um, wrapping the dragon part back around and I'm actually gonna put it on the left side of the dice. So now that I have them at the correct length, I'm just gonna leave it. Um, the benefit to having this ball chain is that while you're driving, um, they will swing and they will wrap around each other, but they will automatically uh, detangle after they go wrapping around each other, as you see there. Um, so you can kind of just let them swing as you're driving and um, wrap around each other. Don't worry about that. And they will untangle on their own, especially since they're spaced a little bit apart uh, due to the size of the back of the mirror. And that's pretty much it. It's pretty simple. Um, if you don't like the length you have it at, go ahead and unwrap it and uh, do it all over again. You really can't go wrong with the lengths that you choose. Um, so just have some fun playing around with them. Uh, if you like these dice, let us know. We're gonna be having them in the shop soon. We custom make them. Um, we don't buy the dice like that. Um, so just give us a buzz or send us a message if you see something you like. And this picture right here is the back of the mirror and it's kind of just showing you how the chain is wrapped around. Um, we hope this video helped you figure out how to hang your rear view mirror charms. Thank you.